Welcome to Reno and the National Bowling Stadium for the U.S. Women's Open Bowling Championships. Hi, I'm Christine Brennan, and today we have the unique opportunity to see whether Kelly Kulik, the greatest women's bowler in the world, can qualify for the finals. Now, we've heard the last few years in golf about Michelle Wee and Annika Sorenstam playing against the men on the PGA Tour. They were invited to play against the men. Kelly Kulik, last year, she qualified to play against the men on the PBA Tour the entire season and had a fine year. Quite a difference and quite an achievement for a woman in the 21st century. Kelly Kulik now is back competing against the women. And now, let's meet the players. Bowling fans, let's meet our number 14 seed from Fullerton, California. A former Team USA member, she is one of three women to win a PBA regional title, Missy Bellender. Our number 11 seed is from Cheektowaga, New York. A two-time U.S. Amateur Champion, she won the 1996 U.S. Women's Open. LJ Liz Johnson. Our number six seed is from Phoenix, Arizona, a member of Team USA since 2001. She won the 2006 U.S. BC Queens. Shannon Bluhowski. Our number three seed from Union, New Jersey, the reigning USBC Queens champion and defending US Open women's champion, Kelly Kulik. And now it is my pleasure to throw it to two gentlemen who have had a long association with bowling, both on and off the lanes. PBA Hall of Famers, Bo Burton and Marshall Holman. Marshall, I've been impressed with how well they bowl, the depth of the field, and we have some really good scoring out there. Well, absolutely. You know, they bowl on very demanding conditions, PBA experience conditions, four of them. They had to make different changes with balls, different changes with their adjustments on the lines. You can see the top 16 players that have made it to the telecast. You know, last week, Carolyn Doran Ballard, she really stepped it up in the 10th frame and was able to win against Kim Terrell. This week, we've got Shannon Flukowski against Liz Johnson and the number one woman player in the world, Kelly Kulik, going against Missy Bellender. And they're bowling on another very demanding condition. This is the fifth PBA condition. It's called the cheetah pattern. It's an outside shot. I think the, the outside shot favors the player who can go in down and in on the first couple boards. And if they get it going, Marshall, they can really shoot some big numbers. And we're going to find out who wins the second week. All right. I'm glad I'm not bowling you on this condition because this was your butter. We have two matches going. Up first is a former U.S. Open champion, Liz Johnson, up on the left.